Hi there, my name is Danny Hornsteiner. I'm an instructor and team leader with a Bavarian mountain rescue. And I also work as a paramedic. As a passionate mountaineer, I've been involved in first aid for a long time. And I've been giving special Alpine first aid courses for over 15 years now. That's why I want to show you what a good first aid kit should contain and what you should look for when you're buying one. As a general rule, every backpack needs a first aid kit. The type and contents of your kit depend on what type of tour it is, who you're with, how many people you're with, the weather conditions, and the duration of the tour. When buying a first aid kit, size and weight play a key role, and its contents are just as important. There are now first aid kits that can be rolled up, making them particularly compact and space-saving. But they still contain all the essential medical supplies, and there's normally space left for personal medicines or small valuables. It's important that the first aid kit is well-structured, so that bandages are easy to grab in an emergency. Different compartments provide good, basic organization for when an emergency becomes hectic. Images and labels provide a good overview and show possible ways for the materials to be used. Every first aid set should contain the emergency numbers and the Alpine emergency signal, either printed onto the kit or, even better, on an emergency card. The emergency card is very helpful for mountain search and rescue because it contains the injured party's key information and the first responder's contact information. There are also some very good waterproof first aid kits that are particularly suitable for glacier tours, excursions, and wet weather conditions. They come in a roll-top bag that keeps the contents especially well protected. The contents are well laid out and wrapped in a protective foil, showing descriptions of possible uses. If you want something even more special, you should go for a sport-specific first aid kit. The Rock Dock has been specially developed for climbers and comprises a chalk bag and a first aid kit. It has a zip on the side that's very easy to access and where all the first aid materials are kept. Even on multi-pitch climbs, when you have to be conscious of weight, you shouldn't go without a first aid kit. In short, a first aid kit should contain adequate equipment, be well laid out, easily accessible, it should contain care instructions, and it should come in a signal color that makes it easy to find in your backpack. Just like the climbing helmet, a first aid kit is part of the basic equipment needed for mountaineering. Participating in a sport-specific first aid course and practicing with the contents of the first aid kit are of utmost importance and can save lives in an emergency. Happy trails!